another gear. Hmm. I'd better not. What happened? I got your pipe back. Let's finish putting this back together. That ain't working any ain't no. Can we do like this? something wrong here Wait, 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 wait. Like that. But then it's this part. I hope it goes. Please? <coughs> Thought so. There you go. Your stove's all fixed. Why, thank you, Mr. Tethers. You FBI types sure are handy. Thank you. Can I ask you something? Of course. You seem relatively coherent. Do people ever talk about seeing, um, little people in pointy hats? Oh, the hidden people. Yeah, it's an old Nordic superstition. My grandfather used to tell me stories. They say they live among us in the ground, trees, rocks. But I just know the ones that live in my window. Hmm. Can you tell me anything more about the hidden people? Oh yeah, tourists love the stories. But Bjorn and his friends take them very seriously. Oh? Oh yeah, they don't like the decorative gnomes in my window. Was Mr. Scruffman working here on the night of the accident? Yeah, the fence outside was a terrible mess. 
I think some kids were trying to rip it down or something. Did it take him long to fix? Oh yeah, all night. If you're still looking for suspects, I'd start looking at that Bjorn fella. But you didn't hear that from me. I already spoke to that guy, though. Well, Mr. Scruffman's alibi checks out. Mike Lobb is dead. And I just saw living garden gnomes. I think I'm gonna head back to the diner and have a chat with Sheriff Bog. But first... Oh, wait, Bjorn is gone. Closed? Hmm. I wonder what happened. I have to complete a pass without breaking any glass. Oh god, is this? I hate it. Can you get any hints? The winning pass begins and ends at the bottom of the screen. I'm just trying to figure out, like, uh, what possible way. Do we have the answer on the bottom screen? Yes, more. It's part of a solution. I already know that one. Without breaking any glass, okay. Okay, so that one's going that one, that one, and that one, that one. But that one is breaking a glass. Da -da 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 -da. That's right. Yes. That was actually a hard one. Well, that was interesting, but I figured it out. Seriously, it gave me nothing. That was worse than nothing. 
Uh, diners. Wait, what? Sorry. There seems to be some tiny footprints in the snow around the diner. But I don't see any kids around here. Possibilities include stealthy children, tiny animals wearing boots. Oh, cats wearing shoes? Nice, Nelson. Now that's going in FBI records. And I'm still recording. Tether's out. <laughs> Those chairs weren't here before, were they? Nope. One of them Nordic guys brought them in right after I ordered my pie. Pie that I'm still waiting for! Hmm. Something odd about them. Something spray painted into stack of vision. Okay. Uh... Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, what? Okay, it does it automatically. Oh, it's a moon. No, wait, that was wrong. Can you? <laughs> um. Wait. Uh, that looks correct. The moon is guessing out something. Yes. Well, that was actually pretty easy. That image you just made? That's the symbol those large guys use. Really? Interesting. What do you guys know about Bjorn? Oh, you mean the old hippie who spies on people out by the hotel? He's one of those old Nordic guys who hangs out at the lodge. Brothers of Skagen's or something like that. Brothers and weirdos if you ask me. Lodge, huh? I'll check it out. There's some tobacco on the counter. I guess the... Hmm. Have you heard about this hidden people superstition? Hidden people? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Uh, you had me going there, Tether. A government agent investigating elves and hippie legends. <laughs> uh, yeah, H how'd you go in there? Have you looked into Bjorn and his friends? He seems to be an avid environmentalist. Perhaps the accident is a political statement. Nah. Bjorn's always been a major part of this community. Since even before my badge was pinning up my diapers. You wore a sheriff's badge on your diapers? This is a community that celebrates its Nordic heritage, Agent Tethers. Not one that advocates violence. I checked up on the repairman. He was working at the hotel on the night of the accident. Alibi checks out, huh? He's in the clear. He couldn't have been involved. That sounds like you have had a busy day. Let's wrap it up for today and start fresh tomorrow. But you haven't really done anything. And we're no closer to getting that factory up and running. Agent Tethers, I'm not from the big city. Around here, we take our time. Keep our heads clear. As far as I can tell, everyone's heads are filled with puzzles. Puzzles are a way to keep yourself from asking questions you don't want answers to. <laughs> what does that mean? It means I'll see you in the morning, Agent Tethers. Oh, well, you started to become a pretty crumpy man. Hello again, Daryl. I don't see the waitress around. Did she go somewhere? That's a good question. I ordered some key lime about 20 minutes ago. Okay, this might sound silly, but have you guys ever...